How could you do this to me, Moana? He said, staring at the video which is playing on his laptop, watching his girlfriend. I'm an ex-girlfriend with another man. It's been two days, you both just broke up and you already replaced him with another man. So this is your reason of breakup, your unknown reason. You are cheating behind my back with him. It's the first time when you meet him. He gripped the laptop tightly like he will break it any time. And then someone knock on his bedroom door made him turn his gaze to the person who just entered. Ami, what are you doing here? Keep the laptop aside and stood up. I'm here to give you this line and warn you if this time you won't listen, you're all power. I will, he said cutting her in midway. This time I'm not going to reject this, I will. I have nothing left for the reason I almost lost everything. She left me for someone else while laughing. She cheated on me with someone else. She laughed. No Jango, she can't do that. I met her. She's such a sweet person. Like her lip being shocked. She can do this. She did it anyways. How is this possible? When the girl did not think twice to jump in front of the car just to save you. She. How she can do this? I don't know. Still, she cheated. I think you should talk with. They have nothing left for talk. Did you think I did not try it many times? She did not. Now I'm finding out she already have someone in her life. Look at this. It's just one bit. She cut off when Django started to slide the videos. All videos are in different time, different dates. Are you still going to take her sign? I was getting full to know from when. I am not going to leave her that easily. If she directly broke up with me, I had no problem, but she literally cheated. It's not acceptable, at last not for me. She only saw my caring, sweet, innocent version, but now I am gonna show her the devil inside mine. I swear I made her regret for doing this with me. She goes to storm out from the room leaving Ami alone. She sighed and followed him from behind. Time skip after two years. Two years. I let you enjoy your life with new love of your life, but not anymore. The pain you gave me by throwing me like I was just a toy. Played with me, betrayed me. Be ready for your messy life, my dear ex girlfriend. Cause I'm back to take revenge from you. This made and burned your last photo, which he had. Sir, here is the file you are asking. Jungkook nodded his hand and took the file from him. He left. Jungkook opened the file and the first thing he saw is your photo. His heart skipped a bit by a smile. He closed the file and rubbed his forehead, not believing himself. You still holding a strong power on him. He can say he is still onto you. He took a deep breath again and opened the file. He flipped your photo, not wanting to distract himself, started to read your profile, but he narrowed his eyes, then smirked. She already got her karma. Her father died by a sudden heart attack after her would be husband. He clenched his jaw, knowing you are about to get married. Husband cancelled the wedding right before the divorce. Not able to take the shock, he got heart attack and died after hours. Now she is living with her father's younger sister. I'm good. But his eyes catch something more made him took his car keys about to leave but where are going in this time? To prepare a trip for my beautiful prey, my dear ex-girlfriend. To undo something without thinking, in the end, you will gonna regret so badly. You just got your position, please don't ruin it. She warned, but he's jungle. He left without caring her words. But I want her. She's not any tie. I don't know who are you, but she's Mrs. Park. I thought she is, that's why you are making deal. I have eyes on her since years. I want her any cost. Your aunt smirk, knowing he's right. I can feel you're gonna thank me for taking all this burden from you. 
I would like to take your proposal, but if you want her, so you have to. One million, is it enough? Your aunt mouth got water hearing the money, but she thought to play hard. Who knows he will be ready to spend more millions for you? I asked, is it enough? Um, one million is okay, but two million, three million? The man keep increasing the price made her almost speechless. Finally, he stopped on 10 million. That's it, 10 million or else I am not interested in. No, no, 10 million is enough for me. Oh my god, I never imagined this unlucky can be money maker machine. From today, she is. She got that all by a man who just entered inside the room made everyone stood up. She was staring at the young man until he spoke. I will give 50 million but I want her as my bride tomorrow. Meanwhile, Ryan, two years, I'm slowly dying by this pain, but I'm happy. He might be happy in his life, said smiling. You took out your diary from the terrace, started to flip the pages. You were smiling, reading about your past life. Your life was filled with joy and happiness with your father, with your sweet boyfriend. But now it's feel like a dream for you, a beautiful dream. You were in mess since your father left this world. The aunt you trusted the most, she turned out a evil. She beats you whenever she wants. And many more things. Also, her son, whom you once loved like your elder brother, he tried to do something bad with you, which he failed miserably. He threw him out the jail for doing the things in his mother supported you, just to be good in front of people, but in home, she will torture you. She goes more violent when you never met her son. Up from the floor, she did not spoke and showed her dress on you. In the morning, tell him, you know, you are getting married, but the person of choice, as expected, he didn't make it in the world. to get a good sleep after tomorrow's time skip tomorrow you are walking toward the stage where your aunt holding your hand pretending to be a good aunt you are looking on the ground accepting your fate you have nothing to do with it if you run from there it would not take any time to find you as always it happened end up being beaten by your aunt please take care of her she said before giving her hands to a would-be husband, he did not answer to hold your hand kind of tightly made you little whimper as your whole body. They are heavy, boorish, which you are hiding by your wedding dress. The dress has long sleeve covering your plump still. I'm announcing you both are husband and wife. You may kiss them bright. You look at the prince kind of confusedly, without taking walls, without taking you both's permission, especially yours. Do you really want to marry him or not? Your heart skipped a bit when the groom turned you to him by your wrist. You started to speak, seeing your ex-boyfriend standing in front of you as your groom. But the thing is, he is not the innocent ex anymore. He turned into a mob boss, a criminal. You started feeling made you almost out of breath. He pulled out and looked at you who is struggling to take breath. 
His legs are struggling, but end up made himself worried because you are not okay. My dear ex-girlfriend, welcome to hell. You can imagine the amount of pain you are going to feel and the angry pain will gonna cause by me. May do regret till your death. You should not play with my feelings once I placed you on my head. Now, I will make sure you will not gonna want to place on my nails, I promise. You are smiling eternally at last it seems. Thanks get at your mansion. Did I made you clear everything? Never dare to enter inside my room. I don't like it. Never interfere in my matters. From now you will go on to everything including cooking, cleaning. He was expecting to hear your voice but you just slowly nodded your head. I need words. I want your words. He said but you did not move made him frustrated. He went to you grab the wrist. You looked at him where tears are building in your eyes feeling pain which he noticed but he chose to ignore thinking you must be pretending his grief was not that strong to make you cry pulling you closer to him made you scratch you never saw him this side cold rude merciless i told you something speak you dumb girl did you lost your voice he said still you are not speaking made him grab your jaw He noticed you are not breathing made him panic more. Hey, open your eyes. Stop pretending, man. You hold your nose started to give you CPR. Chango was not sure what he is doing, but now it only can help him, and it did. You opened your eyes, saw him. His eyes are directly staring into yours. He immediately pulled out and stood up looking here and there not wanting to know. His heart almost come out from his chest. He slowly got up from the floor breathing heavily. If you don't mind can you please show me the kitchen? It's already late. He narrowed his eyebrows being confused by your behavior. Then his eyes landed on your neck which is bleeding and it's caused by him. He pulled in here in front of your neck, not letting him see the thing. Mr. Chiang, please tell me the way of your kitchen. Find it by yourself. I have no time to waste on you by giving you a tour of this house. He strong out from there, not wanting to show you his worried face. He stared at his back until he left. I wish the hate you are showing me it become true. You smiled and looked around, started to look for kitchen. To make dinner. You've been told, you've been told Don't blink, don't run Don't turn left or turn right Or look straight at the sun My mind's gone in circles I'm trying to fight it Get in these voices inside Just stay quiet Go to the place where all this began Just start again Oh, you won't see the light Until the dark
the beneath the bed before you go to sleep. Keep on, I shine. You surely get burned if you reach out and touch. My mind is a battle, I'm trying to hide it. Hitting these voices inside to stay quiet. Under the place where all this began. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving Keep my head up when I act, head up, that's a fact Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track Keep my head up, staying strong, always moving on Feel I don't belong to